All right, so I know that probably tripped us up a little bit, but here is our last transformation. We're going to graph the image of triangle RST after a dilation with a scale factor of one half. And scale factoring might sound really complicated, but it's so simple, I promise. Again, we're dealing with that same figure we previously saw in our uh, rotation transformation. So the scale factor of a dilation is going to be the ratio. Whenever you see the word ratio, all you're forming is a triangle, um, um, <laughs> a fraction, or you're doing the mathematical operation of division. So it's a ratio of a length in the new image to the corresponding length in the ori original figure. So our new image, for every one unit in our new image, you're going to have two units in the original image. Currently, we're looking at the original image, RST, so I'm kind of giving this to you backwards. But it's really simple to do this dilation, and this dilation is a reduction. So you're going to simply multiply the coordinates of the original figure by the scale factor, and our scale factor here is one half. So we're literally taking every x coordinate and every y coordinate and we're dividing it by two. And most people think of dilations as enlarging a figure, but a dilation can also be a reduction in that you can reduce the size of the figure. Okay? So basically, I'm just going to move really fast because our time is almost up. I took the original r and now our prime has been halved. The, dim the coordinate locations have been halved because I multiplied the original location of R in the coordinate plane by one half. And so R was previously located at 510. Now it's located at 2.55. And this is a good example for the person that asks, what if you have a decimal number? you can have any decimal number on the x number line it's just that here i'm showing you a basic example so it wouldn't be apparent that between two and three you have an infinite amount of decimal locations that you could populate okay and i did the same thing to s i just halved the numerical value of its original location i think my time is up. <laughs> Someone's letting me know that I'm going. One of my students are letting me know that <laughs> uh, they like it, but I'm, uh, I'm going on forever, but they're still logged in. Thank you for staying tuned in, and I'm going to speed it up. And I did the same thing to T prime. I have this position, okay? And let's see. There's someone letting me know to wrap things up, I think. Okay, I want to give a special thank you to Maria Hernandez, who coordinated, coordinated this event. She's letting me know that I can um, go a little bit longer. I won't keep you guys too long. The presentation's almost over. Uh, thank you um, to Maria. She's the product, product manager for Take Lessons. I just want to give her a special thank you for coordinating this event. Let me close the chat. Uh, let's see. All right, so yes, again, I basically half the coordinate location, the original coordinate location of T. All right, so the original position was 5, 1. So all I did was um, split that in half, and now I'm at 2.5. 0.5. So again, that person that had the question about a decimal location on a coordinate plane, here you have a point that is, um, has an x coordinate with a decimal and a y coordinate with a decimal, okay? And you can see, like this was so simple, 
our new figure has been negatively dilated. When I say negatively dilated, it's been reduced in size. Because if we're multiplying by a scale factor that it's a, that's a fraction, it has a value less than one. And whenever you multiply something by a value that's less than one, you're reducing, okay? Oh, we have someone else that just logged in. All right, let's, um, sorry if you missed the presentation, but uh, we basically went over different transformations. And this is our last transformation, a dilation. So the dilated points form a triangle that's similar to RST. It's not the same because the size has been reduced. The angular rotation is preserved, but the size has experienced a reduction, okay? So it's similar, but it's not the same to the original triangle RST.